Okay, so what I might actually do is just bring this ed edge flow a little higher. So I'm going to do that just by going to, let's say, uh, one, two edges up. And I'm going to extrude that, those edges here. And I will merge this edge. I'm going to merge this edge to this one. Merge these edges here. And then I have a nice area for a brow. So I'll go to vertex mode and just do a little bit of sculpting. Hold B to soft select. And see I have a little bit of edge flow that can go just around the eyes, which I like. It's going to change the way the ear snaps in, but that's okay. We'll work that back into it. So here's a nice line. And I, I just happen to like this, the way that this is going to flow together. Okay, I'm going to pull this geometry a little closer to here. I'm going to actually insert an edge loop. I have to do it a few times because I haven't merged these vertices. I'm going to insert some edge loops here. And you can see I have some nicer looking, what I think is nice looking geometry. Pull this geometry over here a little tighter. And I think particularly in the face, you want to control your edge loop so that you can have better, you can, it can be prepared for better animation. Snap that in, get my merge verts tool, merge edge tool, excuse me. And I will merge these edges together. Okay, one thing I would also like to do is I don't really like this extra space between the nose and the mouth. So what I'm going to do is just go to face mode, go to my select tool, and just double click that group, delete it. I'll try that one more time, hit delete, and this one here. And I'm just going to put this mouth right up against the nose. I'm going to grab these verts and just vert snap. Now it's stretching just a little bit here, so uh, I'm going to pull this geometry together a little later, a little different way. Pull this up, and I'm going to insert an edge loop. Scale it up. Round it out just a little bit. Push it back. Grab this mouth, grab these verts here. Hit B and soft select it. And I think I'm ready to put this nose back together with this part of the mouth. So I'm going to now go to object mode and recombine these. So mesh combine, go to my merge edge tool and merge back together the nose. And then I'm going to do a little bit of sculpting here. Move 
loosen this up just a little bit. It doesn't need to be all so tight together. I could also grab the interior of this mouth and push it all back further. <laughs> 